Hi children, parents and carers. Um, I know last week I put up a video that I found on YouTube uh, that the children said helps them with their learning in uh, addition for their homework. There isn't one that I can find at the moment, so I'm just going to make my own. Um, just to give you guys an idea of how we have been teaching subtraction in school. Okay, so with subtraction, what we've been asking the children to do is put the smallest number at the start of a number line and the biggest number at the end and then jump up to find the difference. 6 to 11 is a small difference so all we're going to do is jump in ones add one that gets me to 7 add one that gets me to 8 9 10 11 oh sorry 11 goes there. Okay, so then that's my jumps, gets me all the way to 11. All I have to do now is see what's in those jumps. Something I do to help the children visualise it is I draw little Dean's cubes. The children know what those are. That's one, two, three, four, five. Five ones. So five is my answer. When the numbers get slightly bigger, it can get a little bit more complicated. So we put the uh, smallest number at the beginning again, seven and the biggest number at the end, which is 21. So I ask myself now, I have a little bubble here, a thinking bubble, can I add 10? If not, can I add one? So I'm gonna ask myself, can I add 10? Well, I know from my 100 square that seven add 10, seven add 10 is 17. So yes, I can add a 10. So I'm gonna do, jump of 10, which as we've discussed gets me to 17. Okay, can I add another 10? No, because that's gonna get me to 27, which is too high. So now I just do ones, 18, 19, 20, 21, and that's my number. Now here's where the Deans really, really help. So this is a jump of 10, so I draw a long tens Dean. These are ones, so I'm just gonna draw little ones, to represent the one. So that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 is my answer. Okay, I'm gonna do it again for the last one just to make 100% sure. So the smaller number, small number's 23, so that goes down to here. 23 is smaller, so it goes at the front. This is the bigger number, the bigger number goes at the end, 35. Okay, once again, my, my thinking bubble, can I add a 10? Well, 10 more than 23, is 33 so yes I can and actually that's going to get me pretty close so that's 33 All right can I add another 10 no that'll be far too high so it's ones add one 34 add one 35 okay so again I'm going to draw those deans this is a 10 block and these are ones so 10 11 12 is my answer um, I hope this has been helpful can use this at home to go over this. That would be really, really good to help the children just practice uh, and continue to use the addition one that I uploaded last week to help to embed both of those uh, methods. Thank you very much. Happy adding and happy subtracting.